Tom, thank you. We are less than a day away from our next shot at making history, bringing human spaceflight from U.S. soil back to Central Florida. The Crew Dragon atop a Falcon 9 rocket is awaiting liftoff at Pad 39A at Kennedy Space Center. The launch is set for 322 tomorrow afternoon. Right now, NASA and SpaceX mission managers are meeting at the Kennedy Space Center to do another launch readiness review. That's right. Wednesday's launch attempt was, of course, scrubbed due to bad weather. So flight teams are discussing Saturday's weather right now. Yeah, News 6's Eric Von Aiken is live at KSC monitoring all of this. So, Eric, are they actually going to try and go for launch tomorrow? And when will we know? At this point, Ginger, yes, the plan is still tomorrow, but we should know soon, in fact, very shortly, if that's going to change, because this morning the administrator, Jim Bridenstine, NASA administrator, said that towards the end of their readiness review, they would be getting together with the 45th Weather Squadron to take a hard look at the weather and decide, is it too bad tomorrow or is it good enough to give it a try? The rain was relentless on Wednesday, but it wasn't the showstopper. NASA's administrator says it was too much lightning in the air, too close to the launch pad that caused the scrub. Uh, a couple of days ago, we had, we had too much electricity in the atmosphere. Uh, and the challenge there is not that we were in a lightning storm or anything like that. The challenge is that um, a launch could, in fact, trigger lightning. Uh, in fact, the rocket itself could become a lightning bolt. So now NASA and SpaceX are taking a hard look at the weather again for this weekend. Will the weather be good enough, not perfect, but good enough to launch? That when we balance all of these things, there is always, always, always going to be uncertainty. Uh, we could wait another week and we can see that the weather is going to be good. The question is, why is the weather good a week from now? Saturday's forecast is 50-50, according to the 45th Weather Squadron. Sunday's is better. The squadron is predicting just a 40% chance that weather, clouds specifically, will violate the launch criteria. In other words, Sunday is a 60% go. And the NASA administrator was also asked why not just wait for a great week of weather. And the answer is because, as you heard there, there is no really great day. There are so many var variables on any given day. The question is, is Saturday so bad that it's not even worth trying? That's what they're discussing right now. As of now, though, launch still set for tomorrow at 322. But we'll keep you posted all afternoon for now live at the Kennedy Space Center. Eric Von Eichen getting results new six.